is up everybody this is Falska Lam and we are going to be doing a weapon showcase uh, PvP stuff going on here this is actually the first time out of like 20 people uh, well nearly 20 people that is not using the Onikiri in Ubadachi oh my gosh seriously since Sunlight Blade made that video everybody has been using it and they're not that good it's like I'm not saying the weapons are good, I'm just saying the people are not good. Because just spamming the freaking uh, weapon art and trying to attack, that's not that great. I can usually run around them, backstab them. Like w with the weapon art. All right. Well, thanks for fighting, buddy. You're actually not. You're actually decent with that weapon. Well, I don't know. I, I don't find too many people that use a profane great sword. Everybody uses uh, whatever it's called. The other sword. As, yeah, the other sword has the decent weapon art. I do like that. The the flame, the Lorian's flames. Hold on. Using the Lorian's flames, but uh, and then also have that blast. That that blast is extremely nice. I really do like that. Yeah, but but I like the Lothric Holy Sword. Oh, really? Really doesn't even bow. Wait, didn't I invite that guy and then he comes up and attacks me without even bowing? What the hell? Yeah, I, I don't know how to use a Cessus. If I would've used a Buckler, I would've easily been able to parry him. I don't know. Yeah, I have not used a Cessus, so I don't even know the timing on it. But good grief, if you summon somebody, why don't you just, or if you get summoned, why don't you like, hey, dude, what's up? How you doing? Let's fight. Yeah, because it's like, dude, I'm summoning you for a reason. I'm not summoning you just to have you act like an invader. Especially with the washing pole of everything. They said they decreased the range, but everybody's been saying they increased it. <coughs> It feels like it's uh like Dark Souls 2 when they decrease the lightning attack because every or the spear weapons or spear spells because everyone's using it and they never increased it on the miracles and they just decrease the strength, decrease the number of spells and never fixed it. They said, "Oh, we're going to increase the strength and decrease the spell cast number." But they never did. It's like what the hell, dude? Why are you not fixing it? Ah, uh, I seriously, it, it it's a fucking xenophobic Japanese company, and well, just in general, Japanese are xeno extremely xenophobic. They've been like that throughout the history, and seems like the only way to really make them do anything is literally insult them as much as possible in the way that they understand. Oh, what's this guy doing? Okay, shit. I have not seen a freaking spell that pow. That's an extremely powerful spell. Hmm. I have not seen people really ever use this one. Yeah, that I, I don't mind because I've never seen people actually use that weapon. It's like, dude. That's that's a unique weapon to use. Plus, I did tank a freaking fireball with a high-powered with a pyromancer, especially the chaos fireball. I don't know why they why they don't have the great fireball like they had on every other Dark Souls and well, every other game of the iteration, Dark Souls, Demon Souls, things like that. They had a great fireball. But now they just have fire orb. It's like, oh, wow, well, yeah. We're literally 
yeah, we know Dark Souls 2 made magic awesome and so much things, but hey, we're going to take a shit on that and then take a shit on all the innovation that they did and then literally uh, scrap the game down to having less innovation than the first game. Seriously, it seems like that. Seems like they have lowered the innovation down a crap load. Come on, guy. You came to my world. You start attacking me. I'm going to heal. I'm 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 not even not even playing that crap. You come to my world. Come on. Show some freaking respect. Since I summoned you. Okay, I did not get hit by that. Like, what the hell? Seriously, some freaking hyper armor on that shit. Yep. I don't know, I, I feel like I'm using the wrong weapon. Especially when fighting people like that. Especially with having no poise whatsoever. It just seems like the best weapon is the longest pokey weapon is the best weapon you can play as. And I, I don't even know if this weapon has hyper armor at all. I know a few weapons that I've used that have hyper armor. And they actually, it's like, dude, I, I can actually play and fight with this. I have a high chance of winning. But then other times it's like... Like, it's pointless to have anything that is not a long distance, like a freaking pike or something. Or a weapon that does not have hyper armor. If it, if it has no hyper armor, it's like, why even use it? Because you can't tank anything. You can't uh, get smacked and just keep going on. Plus, it's not even like realistic fighting is if you're going to get hit and then you're able to keep going, a single hit's not going to, in the middle of a strike, you're going to suddenly stop your strike. Nah, momentum. Your sword will keep going regardless. I don't even know what weapon that is. Oh, it's not a katana as I thought. Look, I I can't tank through anything. Like, dude, what the hell? Almost got it. Come on. Nope. I would definitely got hit. Why does my Phantom Reach never work, but everybody else's Phantom Reach works? Dude, what are you planning to do? Yeah, I wasn't even planning to attack you, guy. Come on, dude. This Artorius Greatsword. Come on, dude. Oh, what the fuck? I thought I did the freaking shit.
Yeah. Okay. That battle was a little bit longer than I thought. A little bit more uh, taxing. <laughs> I didn't expect it to be that long. And literally that much thinking and all that crazy stuff is like, dude, that's kind of an intense battle right there. I'm glad I had a different weapon. Equip two weapons at the same time, or two different weapons. I can at least attack with range with this. Yeah, it's not the strongest weapon, and it's only at a plus three. I can go a little bit higher. But... I don't think I have the titanite scales. Yeah, I need eight, or four, or six, something like that. I don't know. Probably four. Just need to buy two more. I'm already past the level. But they do look so similar just a way it's kind of rotted there. Or like it looks like it's been tossed in the abyss. Kind of looks like, hey, it's Artorius's weapon. What is this guy doing? Oh, he's going to be one of those guys. Come on, guy. Yes, I can roll a whole bunch too. Come on, dude. You're coming up here with a freaking... Come on, dude. You don't even have a parry shield. That's not going to parry that easily. Especially with lag. Good grief. Even with this, I have to kind of predict people attacking. And that and the buckler has the biggest parry frames in the game. It's like, dude, what the hell? Why do I have to predict it? Why can't the whatever uh, the prediction software is annoying? Plus, it'll be a lot better if they actually did the dedicated servers like they were talking about. Freaking from Dark Souls 1 is like, oh yeah, we're going to make actual uh, servers so you guys can play on so there'll be less lag. And now it's just player to player connection. And there's really no host and nobody like that. Oh, the host is a server technically. But still, it's like, dude. Hey, an actual Dark Wraith. Okay, now let's see. What's this guy gonna do? Okay, I have a stronger weapon than you, buddy. My attacks will do a lot more damage. And I I think I have hyper armor. Hyper armor for... Yeah, for two-handed. Like, come on, dude. I don't. If there's hyper armor on that, that would be so freaking annoying. Alright then, buddy. Thanks for playing. <laughs> but hey, that's pretty rare to see somebody actually doing a full Dark Wraith cosplay. I don't mind fighting the Dark Sword there or people spamming and that guy really wasn't spamming he was actually he actually tr did several different attacks with it he just didn't r1 he just didn't r1 yeah let's keep going i'm gonna win i'm gonna win because i'm better player than you and all i know how to do is press r1 yay yeah yeah it's not one of those dicks that's just like oh i'm just going to press r1 i'm going to run yeah look how badass i am like yeah yeah no no fuck you fuck you Come on, dude. You're the reason why the freaking PvP scene, there's so much hate in it. I'm surprised. For freaking literally an hour before I was filming this, I was fighting nothing but only carrying Ubadachi players. Seriously. Bleed and just keep going. Uh, I'm going to do the weapon art, weapon art. Run around. Oh, you slice. Hey, backstab. Yeah. Now, who is this guy? Okay, yay. 
I'm wondering, is the green blossom actually that good? Okay, okay. Now, what are you doing, buddy? Yep. I want to see what you do. I'm not going to fight you right out, expecting you. I'm going to keep over here watching. Yeah. It's no sense why an attack like that is freaking unblockable. Or not unblockable, but unparryable. Yep, I have a longer... Well, we have about the same length of sword with Phantom Reach for me. the hell? That, that dealt a lot of freaking damage. Freaking mosquito in my face too. <laughs> okay, okay. So I don't accidentally freaking press. Yeah, dude. Yeah, I'm not finding you, especially with that buff on. Yeah. Come on, dude. You actually had a better chance fighting me with that other... With the store great sword. Yeah, since literally... I literally just found out that this thing had hyper armor. Okay, okay. Oh, parry bait, huh? Thank you. Take any free hit I can get. Oh, I would definitely would have got hit by that. Yeah, dude, come on. No parry bait, please. Please, no parry bait. Alright. Oh, thanks for fighting. I fought you before, but literally you had a different completely weapon set up and everything. That's good. Changing up your style. That is very important. Changing up your style, not keeping the exact same thing all the time. Because that does get very annoying. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Okay, okay. I'm I'm just doing the showcase right now. I'm being Artorius, okay? If I had the Great Shield, I would be using the Great Shield. But I'm using this because it gives me recovery. And I have this. Yeah, badass. <laughs> it's not that strong, but it's a good weapon set. Or move set. I like it a lot. Alright, so... I don't know this weapon. I rarely see people ever use this weapon. Yeah, I don't know. Is mine stronger or yours stronger? Uh, good fight, buddy. Good fight. Hope you can hear that before you disappear. <laughs> we were I don't know if we were trading pretty much exactly the same. I felt like we were trading the exact same damage the whole time. Oh... Summon, damn it. <laughs> Some, I like summoning two people at least at the same time, too. Because if I die, you know what? At least somebody can benefit off of it. Or two people can benefit off of it. Because I'm at 120. I have nearly half a million souls in extra. Well, yeah, nearly 600,000 souls. 
I don't need souls. If people want souls, go for it. And plus, I, that's one thing too that's pretty fun is, yeah, this is my blood, but hey, <laughs> I'm literally covered in blood. You can see the red. Some people say it's ash. No, dude, no, look. It's on armor. It's red. It's on a shiny surface. Hey! What? Lame. Hey. Okay, goody, goody. Now let's go. Yeah, come on. Oh yeah, and I found out that the spin attack with this weapon is literally can be blocked. I don't know, I'm going to try parrying that. Okay, he's expecting like, oh, he's going to parry me. He knows what I'm going to be doing. Oh, wow. I dodged that. I did not think that was going to happen. Don't heal, guy. Come on. Yes, I am going to do this. If you're not going to come near me. Wow. That. I have never seen that before. I hit somebody in the middle of an attack. And they literally spin around. That's freaking awesome. <laughs> that is pretty damn cool. I have never seen that before. Um, and yeah. I can't summon anymore. Or, or was that me? I swear I saw the person spin. I don't know if it was completing the attack or in the middle of an attack and then the animation just had to uh, spin around to complete or to just get to the right angle. But dude, that, that was actually pretty damn cool. I like that a lot. Uh, and... Seems like... Oh yeah. I'm freaking filthy. Covered in blood. <laughs> Where's Itchy Green when you need him? You just don't want a little blood. You want to be covered in the stuff. Mire and its foul stench. <laughs> oh. Seriously, those little dwarf, uh, the dwarf doll creature things in Dark Souls 2. Those NPCs were actually pretty interesting. Especially Itchy Green was the most interesting one. Really? What happened? Did, did you die? Did you get invaded? What What happened, dude? Seriously, that, that's two freaking summons. That did not... That didn't get summoned. Like, what the hell, dude? Three freaking summons that aren't summoning. I don't know what's up with my connection now. It's not working, dude. What the hell? WTF, yo. Yeah, dude, you're, you're literally seeing I'm just freaking trying to summon anyone. Finally. About damn time. That took forever. What the hell? Guy, no bowing? Oh my god. I know what what you're planning to do. That thing is freaking scary, especially the sound of it slicing. That's a scary sound right there, dude. What are you doing? Come on. Come on, dude. That usually hits most people. Oh, 
Oh, wow. I have never been parried with that attack. Seriously, I've never had anyone ever parry me before with that. With the Artorius up thrust. Nope, I, I'm not going in. Not going in for that hit. I know what happens. I know the second part of that. Yeah, dude. Yeah, th this guy just ro running around too much. I I really don't know how to. Oh crap! That did a lot of damage. I thought my life bar was at least at half. Shit. That did a lot. Hmm. Okay. My life's bare, well, barely over a thousand ish. Eleven hundred. Now let's summon someone. Seems like the summons hardly ever work until I get my souls. Then now listen. You can hear the boosh. Yes. Even sometimes when I do that, it doesn't work. It's kind of like, dude, whoa, what the hell? I don't know why, but it does. I, I, I've been hearing a lot of people, they literally cannot get summons. They see no summon signs. They're at boss areas and everything. They're like, dude, I see zero, zero summon signs everywhere. I don't see summon signs anywhere. Why can't I summon anyone? White Phantom they're talking about. But red, they see red everywhere and they get invaded like crazy. I have seen that. I hardly ever see any white signs. I, all I see are red. Red everywhere I turn. Oh, hey! Nice. What is this guy gonna be doing? Do they literally not see me? Oh, <laughs> they probably don't see me. They're probably literally fighting right there. And they don't see me. That's kind of, that's pretty interesting. They probably like, oh, hey, there's no one there. Oh, crap. Okay, well, they're not terribly strong, but hey, the guy's doing pyromancy stuff. Oh, crap. That's, yeah, he's doing the dual demon fists. That's really interesting. <laughs> Is she doing that uh that flamethrower attack? Oh crap. I did not know you could parry that. Two handed. That weapon two handed, damn. Good work, guy. <laughs> now let's fight. Oh, crap. Yeah, I guess he was too close. Yep, sorry. I know, it's a very strong weapon. Oh crap, wow. That was a good fight, seriously. That guy was a good fighter. Oh, enjoy guy, thanks for the fight. Anyways everybody, thanks for watching, like and subscribe, and uh... And I'll miss you all, and remember, love the Kellhound.